the International Maritime Organization has required a 40% reduction in greenhouse gas emission by 2030 compared to the 2008 baseline. And they're even aiming at zero emission by 2050. So do you actually make a high upfront investment in order to manufacture a zero emission ship right now, which is going to last for the next 30 years or so? Or do you actually invest in maintenance programs in order to gradually drop the emissions of the, um, of the existing vessels on the market? The answer is maybe in between the two, but in any case, uh, softwares are going to help you to, to realize these ones.